This was how much I paid for this dress. I travel this, I mean store to Lolita. Must be Black Friday. So if you haven't checked out my previous buys from Lily Silk, unlike other YouTubers, I don't have a discount code. I use other YouTubers because they how they seem to promote everything I buy is for my own money. I sliced this open because I literally bought this yesterday. I have gone back to my emails to be like, what? And I can see it says Lily 21 hours ago. That's incredible. Of course, it does make a difference because I'm here in China. I ordered during Black Friday. We have no idea why I've got three things. I know what this is because I bought it. So they're trying to be more sustainable now. It may be with Black Friday there sending free stuff. Oh, this is not what I bought. I have no real need for a silk scrunchie. I'm sure it's lovely. Silk is always good for your hair. Oh, it's just to say that the packaging's 100% recyclable. This would be great if I was at home, which was where I was the last time I opened a Lily Silk package. But because here in China, at least where I live, all of the rubbish is in the same bin. Getting the cashmere cheaper is always great. This particular one is the 60% off sale, which by the time I upload this, I don't know how much stock they will necessarily have of this particular item. But I am noticing with Lily Silk, and I'm pretty sure I commented on and the other two items that I own, I find their items to be quite short, like their clothing. I've never bought pants from there because I'm a little bit, even though you can get them customized, which I would totally recommend, it, um, you can't return them, so you definitely have to get your measurements right. But I customized the pajamas that I bought from there and they've been brilliant. I actually saw it this morning, yesterday, Holly Madison, actually, of all the YouTube people that I watch. It's because she's got her podcast thing going at the moment that I'm quite enjoying. She actually had this item, but I am noticing that they're making, they're getting rid of these bigger sizes and only doing up to like size 12 or size 14. And that's like the biggest size they do. I've continued to wear all of the items that I've had. I've had no problems with anything I've bought except the pajamas, the but one button popped off and I took it to a dry cleaner not that long, oh, it was over summer, and he sewed them all on because they're just there, just the one piece of thread that they had through was done really cheaply and I'm like, oh, yeah, for 200 odd dollars, that's not great, but I'm, yeah, it's an easy fix. Anyway, let's get into this one. So as I said, I bought this on the final clearance, so I cannot return this, unlike other items which you can return. So it's just a very plain black dress. I hope it fits, but my backup plan is I will wear it as like a nightgown. I am completely aware that it has got the thinnest little straps, and uh, my bra straps are far thicker than this. But honestly, I don't care because my, bra my bras are black anyway. But I just know for me that my bra straps are going to stick out past the strap of the dress. They are adjustable. The link that I have in the description box below is for the same dress. I will have the link if they've still got it of this exact size because this is the final sale then they only have this size. The regular one that is exactly the same dress, I believe it only goes up to a size 12. I don't know why they're reducing and not making for normal size bodies. <laughs> because this is, okay, it's made in China, but because they market it to so many Western people, we have different figures. And I'm hoping it goes just past my knees. All right, let me go and try this on. Okay. So, yippee, it does go below my knees, or at least to my knees. This is 22 mm, and this is extra, extra large. It's on final clearance, like final sale. It means I can wear it in winter quite comfortably because I can have boots on, and then it's not just relegated as a summer dress. I can also wear it as a skirt. So, that was my thinking. Because I have big boobs, my bra straps are thicker than than it. So, I typically take, I think my jeans, I'm sorry, I'm trying to think because American Americans have different sizing. I think it's a size 12 jeans. I have a pair of Old Navy ones. I think they're a size 12. And for New Zealand Australian viewers, this is a Katmandu top. So, oh, this is a size 16. 
um, Cat Men Do Top. So typically a size 14, 16 Australian sizing. But I know I have big boobs. So there is a little bit of give here that that's great. It feels so lovely. As I said, it's the 22. It's a little bit chilly in here now that I've not got much on. <laughs> Let me make this quick. First impressions, really pleased. It's that lovely, the shiny silk. Sitting down now, <laughs> I wanted to pull down a bit, but I'm pleased that when I stand up, it does go to knee. I'm hoping this will be in my closet for a long time. A, as something to wear out, and then B, if I want to wear this as silk sleepwear. I hope it can do both. It is marketed as like the, the little black dress that you can wear everywhere. I don't know if you can, the A-line shape. It's so hard because it's literally straight out of the box to be able to really appreciate it, but it certainly doesn't cling. And even though I'm a bigger body than what they are ultimately going for, I, I like it because it has got a little bit of room actually everywhere. So it feels really nice. <laughs> I've the scratchy here. Yeah. <laughs> oh At the back, can you see? No, actually, so it goes really nicely. So it covers the bra at the back, which is great. Honestly, I really like this. I'm more impressed than what I thought I'd be. And obviously it would be better if I had shapewear on underneath and wore it with my jandals. It totally works. I just think it's just such a beautiful basic item. And it has definitely been, I know it's one of those things that you should have, like your little capsule wardrobe. And of course in winter, you have coat on, have a, I don't really have cardigans. Definitely check their size guide, but it feels so nice. Oh my goodness. Ooh. I'd wear this to work, that's what I'm thinking. I put tops over it, I put jerseys over it, and make it look like a skirt to wear to work even. So that I can get a lot of use out of that summer or winter. This is going to be beautiful. Black Friday sale. Have a look at my other videos of other items I've bought from Lily Silk over the years. All of them I still have and I have them with me here in China. If you are a bigger body like myself, they seem to be going out of these. So their final sale, really do check it out because some of those prices are really nice.